before the 2024 Super Bowl, Travis Kelce responds to speculation about Taylor Swift's engagement. All they can think to ask Travis Kelce is whether or not Taylor Swift will be his bride. However, the Kansas City Chiefs tight end refuted any engagement rumors as he gets ready for Super Bowl 58. At a press conference on February 5th, he said to reporters, I'm focused on getting this ring, referring to the prize given to Super Bowl winners. That's all my mind is focused on right now. Nevertheless, the Chiefs player made it a point to congratulate his significant other on her Grammy victories at the ceremony on February 4th. She's amazing, he said to the press. She's rewriting the history books herself, and I told her I'd have to hold up my end of the bargain and come home with some hardware too. The Tortured Poets Department, Taylor's 11th studio album, will be released on April 19th. Although she won two awards at the 66th Grammy Awards, Best Pop Album and a historic fourth album of the year trophy, the announcement of her album may have been the event's most exciting moment. I have heard some of it, yes, and it's unbelievable, he said. I can't wait for her to shake up the world when it finally drops. In addition to revealing the tracklist for her upcoming album on February 5th, Taylor further piqued the interest of Swifties with her praise from Travis. Between the songs, Fortnite, a collaboration with Post Malone, and Florida, featuring Florence plus The Machine. Another song that fans have noticed is called So Long, London, which seems to be a reference to her British ex-boyfriend Joe Alwyn.